Welcome to Hardcore Garage. I'm about to take the next step. I decided I was just going to get some drywall and hang up there. And I was going to stand it up. Two full pieces, cut the other one, done. But like always, poor planning on my fault. Kind of put a halt to that, let me explain. Well, everything here when you build is going to be 16 on center or 24 on center. Since this isn't a load bearing, it's just uh, <laughs> cosmetic basically. 24 inches on center is su sufficient. Okay, well, <clears throat> what I did was this should have been half of a board since I'm starting in a corner. Notice I don't have one over here too. More poor planning on my fault, but I got that covered. Anyway, this should have been a half. Now, 24 inches ends right here instead of in the center. So I can't have my drywall not touching. I guess I could space it out over there and cover it with a sliver or figure something out like over there, but I'm not going to do that. What I'm going to do is just go ahead and run it. It's just shy of 10 foot, which as soon as I decided I was going to throw it sideways, I panicked. I thought for sure it's going to be more than 10 foot, but it isn't. It's like just shy, half a quarter inch shy of 10 foot. So I just got to cut a little bit off the two bottom ones. And then cut the top one down to two foot, which will be great because this is five eighths fire rated. It's pretty thick and heavy. I also screwed up that piece. They were nice and, and new <laughs> when I loaded them. Must have been a little piece of something under there, but it rolled it and whatever. That one's going to be the bottom one behind the shelves. We're good. I got all the drywall hung last night. Back there. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure I explained how I screwed up and I had to end up doing it the other way, but that's my life, man. <laughs> um, getting ready to paint. want to show you guys another little trick that I came up with on the fly because I'm unorganized and can't keep track of my stuff. So check this out. This is a drawer with a little piece of square tubing under it. Becomes my paint pan. I had the plastic liners, I just couldn't find my metal paint anywhere, so you gotta do what you gotta do. Let's get this wall painted. Poof! It's gray, matches the bench. No, I didn't finish the drywall, I didn't cover anything. Seams, screw holes, nothing. It's gonna be covered up by shelves to eight foot tall, so there's only gonna be two foot of it showing at the top. I'm good with it. Till the next time, I will update again as soon as we get them shelves and, get, and maybe show you putting them together. I'm, it ain't very hard to do, but keep on trucking, people.